presentation by students of Igbene Young Education Center at the 2014 Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Day. In his opening speech, the Provost College of Education Ikeadolo, Professor Ame Uwagu, who chaired the occasion, spoke on the significance of the long walk to freedom while commending the school authorities for inculcating in the young ones the virtues of good leadership. The guest speaker, Professor Richard Idubo, noted that what Martin Luther King achieved did not come on a platter of gold. A dream was born. A dream that one day the nation, that's America, will rise up, live out the dream of its creed. People are born free, but everywhere they are in chains. And that was revolting to human rights activists like the person who we are doing honor to today. And that is Dr. Martin Luther King. While welcoming guests, the Deputy Chairman of the Board, Ibnedion Education Center, Her Excellency Lady Cherry Ibnedion, expressed appreciation for the large turnout of guests. She said her husband, Sir Chief Dr. Gabriel Sawar Ibnedion, had to cancel his trip to Ghana because of the caliber of dignitaries expected at the event. On behalf of the Board, I would like to express profound thanks to God Almighty for our presence here today to witness the 214 edition of the annual observance of Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King Day. On her part, the principal, Montessori Primary School, Mrs. Phil Igweze, said this year the school drew inspiration from Africa as the students dwell on the life and times of Dr. Nelson Mandela, some of Nigeria's national heroes and the centenary celebrations. One-time winner of Big Brother Africa, Uti Nwachuku, who is an ex-student of the school, rendered a special song with the student choir. The occasion featured Carnival by the Montessori Primary School pupils and drama presentation on exile of Oba Obarame to Calabar, as well as the famous freedom speech. I have a dream that one day this nation will rise up and live out the true meaning of the screen. Yes. We hold this truth to be self-evident that all men are created equal. I have a dream that one day on the red hills of Georgia, sons of former slaves and sons of former slave owners will one day sit together at the table of brotherhood. The Honorary Romanian Consul to Edo and Delta States, Chairman, Board of Igbenedion Education Center, and the S. Summer of Benin, His Excellency Sir Chief Dr. Gabriel Sawa Igbenedion, and the South African High Commissioner to Nigeria, His Excellency Lulu Louis Aaron Ngumi, commented on the event. I thank the management to be and and I feel humbled by the excellent uh, act of the people of Nigeria, especially His Excellency Chief Ekbenidion. We really feel that this will make Mandela to live on forever. It will produce a new type of leadership that will emulate Mandela. Some guests and students who said they were proud of the school commended the founder, Sir Chief Dr. Gabriel Sawari Benedion. What I've come here to see today has really given me hope about this country. I really like to commend the management and staff of this institution. Benedion Montessori Education Centre is an example to other people to follow. To see uh, two world um, leaders who have to shape the event um, around the world to be celebrated today in, um, in this school, um, it is gratifying to see that um, people are being given practical education. Today has been a great day to celebrate that great man. He has been a wonderful man, the great Madiba of Africa, Dr. Nelson Mandela, and Dr. Martin Luther King. Today, today is his birthday. The statue of Martin, Martin Luther King Jr. and Mandela was nine. High point of the ceremony was the unveiling of the statue of Dr. Nelson Mandela by the High Commissioner of South Africa to Nigeria, His Excellency Lulu Louise Aaron Ngumi. Dignitaries who graced the occasion include Anglican Bishop of Benin, Right Reverend Peter J. Imashwe, the Commander, 81 Maritime Group, Air Komodo Olaniyi Awomodu, represented by Squadron Leader Victor Onu, 
Assistant Corps Commander, Federal Road Safety Corps, Mr. Ifabi Victor, amongst others. Pius Nsogo, reporting. <laughs>